It has stood in the center of town for 150 years, but plans to demolish an historic town hall are moving forward. Now many residents in Tabernacle Township are saying, mm, not so fast. New Jersey reporter Ryan Hughes has the fight to save a piece of history. Here at Tabernacle Town Hall, residents are, have gathered for a protest. There have been peaceful protests and signs have been placed in yards in Tabernacle Township as many people fight to save their historic and beloved town hall. People here are long, lifelong residents. They grew up here, they've done dances here, they've gotten married here. It's our home. Catherine Crane also got married here in 1997, and for the past few months, she and other residents have been leading the charge to keep the town hall standing after the township committee voted to demolish the building during a meeting in February. It's very upsetting. It's sad that we, they can so easily just rip down history. The building was built in 1874 by the Junior Order of United American Mechanics and was given to Tabernacle Township in 1960. People look to this building uh, as the center of town. But according to the township, the building has been deemed unsafe by engineers and is a threat to public safety. The township sent CBS News Philadelphia photos showing cracks in the foundation and the basement wall deteriorated. In a statement, the mayor said in part, it is heartbreaking that the building was allowed to degrade into its current unsafe condition, resulting in this committee having little choice but to demolish the structure to prevent a potential tragedy. It is fiscally irresponsible to spend millions of dollars of taxpayer money to try to salvage a building that has been ignored and neglected for decades. But Crane says, not so fast. Today, we are following an injunction to have it stopped. Crane says a community-wide fundraising campaign also generated more than $10,000 in a week to pay an independent engineer for a second opinion. But she claims the committee said no. We hired them to work for us. We pay them to work for us. They're ignoring the plea of the people of the town. The mayor says asbestos removal will begin on Friday. Once that's completed, demolition has been set for next Wednesday. Residents tell me they are planning another peaceful protest here at 11 o'clock Sunday morning. In Tabernacle Township, Ryan Hughes, CBS News, Philadelphia.